rise. Right, <laughs> um, What am I saying? Well, yeah. Um, yeah, right. Um, what's the day? Uh, it's a it's Friday the seventh. It might be the eighth. I don't know. It's the eighth of um, January, and we are picking the motorhome back up. Which is not here. It's probably in the thing. It's not unless it's been robbed. Oh shush! And we're going to find out what's happening with it. What work it needs doing. If it's past the hab check. Which it won't have. Oh, oh sh well, it shouldn't have. And water ingress. I'd be shocked if that's actually passed. Yeah. But we shall see. So, back in a bit, we'll let you know what's happening. Bye. Wave. <laughs> right, Carl's in there now. So, just got to wait and then I've got to follow, follow him back. So, probably update when we get back. Do it from the motor. Maybe. Yeah. God, can't even see it. So if I've got it inside, I've got to remove, bloody move the one behind it first. Look, I don't think you can see. Yeah, Premier towing. See, look, you've got a motor on there, and you've got one there with the birdies on the back. So if you're watching this video, and that's your motor, right? they're working on it, I think. I presume they're going to have to move that one to get ours out. See, but we might moan. Swift. Don't know. I think it is. I think it's a Swift. So look, they have problems too. Oh look, and there's a thing there, look. Solid construction. Exclusive to Aldi's. Meant to be ten years, so they better do the bloody work, hadn't they? Yeah. We shall see. Right, we're in the motor home. We've got the motor home back and we're back home. And this is how cold it was in the night at the workshop. That is water that was left in our sink and it is frozen. Look, it does look cool though. <laughs> you got to admit. But, oh, God, bloody freezing and all. Right, um, it failed the hab check. Um, Carl fitted a, well, lock department shelf. Yeah. Carl fitted a shelf in the gas locker, as you can see, and there, fitted, and, fitted a light. and he fitted a light, and I said, oh, is that focusing, yeah, he fitted a light, which I said can, obviously, if you got a leak, it could blow up, but Carl said it's LED, so he wouldn't do that anyway, um, Aldi fluid was low, um, and just a couple of things that he's got to like just put a sticker label somewhere where he's done his own work um the gastro under the bed which broke the very first time we lifted it which was down to Aldi's being crap that's where our damp is and then not good readings at all that's the percentage of damp there 40% there, 50% there, none on the back, none on the front. Is that the floor and the ceiling as well? Yeah. I presume the top one's the floor and the bottom one's the ceiling. Presume so. Okay, right, so she'll be able to see that. Damp in the top that we all know about, they've put the claim in. They've put the claim in? They're, put, they're putting the claim in, so we've got to wait and see. Yeah. And yeah. then in the floor which is apparently quite common you can see the staining just coming up through there and a bit there both sides is coming up through the okay. floor so that side and the same on that side and that one yeah okay that's it everything goes is fine okay right but we'll show you outside and why the why the water ingress is coming yep. which you've got to do anyway but we've had our new panel there so that's all nice and sparkly and new. Did they do the seal on the thing or not? No, I'm not so. And I've got and to it... put my shelf back up now. Yeah, and it doesn't move anymore. No. Yeah, see, they have done a really, they have done a good job of that. Yeah. Oh wow, we're getting luck. 0.2. That's crap. Crap. 
Yeah. Ooh. Cheers. God, that's Overcast. really noisy on the thing. Right yeah, it's been bloody snowing all day, on and off. Tell us the story. Right. Jack and Ori. Apparently, right. when Aldis fit these bottom trims, they just put a bit of sealant on, stick it on, and that's it. And when you're driving down the road, all this flexes, and it comes away and it splits all around there. So the, and yeah, and then go right. So there's like a little lip thing there, which is where the water drains off the roof, and then it runs round the awning. Down here, on the window, drips all the down. You can see the line. It drips all down here, and then goes behind. There's a little gap in the seal there where the seal's gone, and then it just goes behind the seal. And where the floor sits like that, it actually goes in and it comes at the front. Apparently the bloke do loads and loads like this. So has he put in the claim for that as yes, well? Yeah, yes. The top. I presume it's the same thing. The same thing. The water drips all the way down, same as the other side. It comes down, you can see the line where the water's been dripping down. Yeah. And goes behind it. This panel is actually coming away already. Right. So the water then goes down and it sits in like a sponge and then soaks up on the inside. So what he has to do is take all this off. They put eaters to dry all the floor out. When the floor's properly dried, they then seal it the life out of it and put it back on. The crack oh, yeah. isn't warranted. Oh, isn't it? No, so they won't warrant that, that because it's over 12 months old. Anyway, show our decals now. There's our one decal. Isn't it nice? And there's our other one. Very, very nice. Off eBay. <laughs> weren't they off eBay? Them ones, weren't they? Yeah. Mum Carl and his sad, bloody... Sado. Not for long, he's got to sell them all. <laughs> it's good. Yeah, so we fitted that shit, made it fail. And my LED light. For when and his little LED light. For when it's dark. Which is absolutely great, that is. So you didn't say you've got to change it? No, no, nothing whatsoever. He just says that because they work through certain standards, that's not part of what Aldi say you're supposed to do, even though a lot of people do it. Even though? Yeah. <laughs> even though, <laughs> even though a load of people do it, he says because he's doing the app check, he has to go by the rules, and the rules are no shelf, no lighting. Okay. Right, so that's it then. So it's we'll let you know when hopefully been passed and then goes in. Looks like our full time dream's gonna be a bit delayed. And yeah. you gonna put a tarpaulin on it or not? On that. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, I might, I might duct tape it. Then sure you don't want gorilla tape. No, duct tape. Change our name to the travel troll.